it's your boy homo ziggy we back here with another reaction and sorry if you heard that noise and such but we here it's kind of like a music mayhem it's basically like this we here with the fantastic four we got rustage we got game boy jones we got divide and we ended it off with mr fable himself and such so hey make sure you watch all the way through man because i would really appreciate it if y'all do but either way we on the road to 2k man we almost we're like 700 away from there and such but hey either way hit that subscribe button man because you already know i'll be trying my best to pump out these musics these reactions as much as i can so the first song we got is game boy jones with his yusuke Yurameshi rap song yusuke remix and it's featuring jive again so make sure you like comment and subscribe follow me on my socials up there and without further ado let's get in the video time we heard these two together on a song was on that Vegeta was it a was it a Vegeta yeah it was the Vegeta song bad man and such so hey and they went fire on that not only for the AMV but also the music video so hey this like like playboy cardi vibe and such with the noise not noise like with his voice and such the only difference is jive actually speaking some bars because i don't know what the fuck it playboy cardi be saying most of the times That's more of a pop song than a rap song. If this is like the remix or so, how was the original one? I don't know, but so far I feel like the remix is way more better. Then I always see the signs too late. Fucking with the homies, then you know I gotta slide. Chopping with the beam, I gotta tuck right by my side. Said that you'd be there for me, I guess that was a lie. Now we last forever, but forever is the night. Then what happened to the passion? Like the post, but nothing's perfect on the back end. Nothing I would do for you was gaining any traction. Now I'm thinking nothing, I still see you while it's lacking. The girl makes me drop that like slow time, she's gorgeous. I'ma buy a house for an ass, pay the mortgage. Shotty is my. Nah. Well, then again, hey, if, the, if your girl is that loyal and is that, that important to you, then hey. Go for it. Traction. Now I'm taking nothing. I still see you while it's lacking. The girl makes me drop that like slow time. She's gorgeous. I'ma buy a house for an ass. Pay the mortgage. Shawty is my gay girl. And my demons they love. She's the only one I wanna take off. This could 
have been all of yours. This could have been all of yours. Now nobody even miss you, but that ain't my issue. Yeah, yeah, I've been yeah. Driving in the water, sinking like the Titanic. Okay. I'm falling. You got me deep, but I see no flame. You're falling. All the tears always running down your face. I guess it's all me. You always point the finger, you can't. <laughs> you don't have a heart, so you took mine to shame. Fire too. Hey, shout out to Game Boy and Jive, man. Hope I'm saying that name right, cause I always feel Hello, like I'm not. Mutual. How can we insure you? Either way, oh, that's something. Send it fire. right over. There we go. Oh, that's too bad. Yeah. Well, unfortunately, mech damage isn't covered. Right. Next, now we got Rustage, Mr. Rustino, with a Detective Conan rap. Face close. Do it like. Case closed. I said the name and the day froze. I put the pieces together, then lay out the facts, tell the truth. I don't make jokes. Do it like case closed. Run for the yumps, I gonna lay low. They know I'm guessing this was from like a, cause he, cause the last. I'm guessing. He, well, hold on. Let me try to get my sentence across. I'm guessing this was from like a stream request or so, cause the last time he did a song like that was just out of nowhere was with the Ben 10 song if you haven't go check out my reaction to that where he literally did like he he make literally made people in the stream ask him which songs he wants him to do and such gave him like eight songs and then in a tournament to see which song which one would be the most better and henceforth you got the Ben 10 one so I'm guessing this one is definitely from a stream one and this production by Kiwi do it like Case closed. I said the name and then they froze. I put the pieces together, then lay out the facts, tell the truth. I don't make jokes. Do it like case closed. Run for the yumps, I gonna lay low. They know that I do it better, cause once you reveal, it's like a point in his case closed. For the moment they hit the floor, I'm a dog on the case of the kids adored. Like the government police, they be misinformed when I put them to sleep, but they're rich and more immature. Leave a bit of taste, cause the gin is pure. Ain't no junior league, you're like Mitch and George. Every deadly turn, you be pen and words, but I'm like my dad, cause I've written more. They don't deal with that. Kite old kid, I steal the track. Lines they give to me, keeping tabs, and they spill their Lines like a leaky tap, yeah. better the map yeah. and Spill their lines like a leaky tap. Okay. And hey, once Rustage always comes on a drill beat and such, you know he always finna kill it no matter what. Or to be deadly turn, you be better than worse. I'm like my dad, cause I've written more. They gon' deal with that. Kite okay, now I steal the track. Lies they give to me, keeping tabs. So they spill their lies like a leaky tap. Better peep the map and read the hand. I modulate my voice with the words. We speak the facts of feeding rats. You don't want your secret cracks, but I'll be hitting more goals in a FIFA match. Yeah, way I kick all the moves. I be hitting more goals than a FIFA match. Hey, shout out to all my FIFA soccer players out there and such. No, FIFA football. Because I don't know why. Hello, it's football, not soccer. Speak the fans yeah. repeating rats, you don't want your secret cracks But I'll be hitting more goals in a FIFA match Yeah, way I kick all the moves like Ran Rachel ain't got a goon fight back Painful, I make a dude quite mad I deduce my plan like a dude finance Say they're nice but I shoot my hand Aim it to waste if you shoot like that Cono Sherlock Holmes that I quote When you blow down the slope the truth might stand Do it like Case closed. I said the name and then they froze. I put the pieces together, then lay out the facts, tell the truth. I don't make jokes. Do it like case closed. Run for the yumps, I gonna lay low. They know that I do it better, cause once you reveal, it's like a point in his case closed. Do it like case closed. I said the name. Hey, y'all let me know. Who y'all think? Which one you think Red Rustage does better more on? His beats or other people's beats? Because we can make an argument about how when it comes to his beats, he be going crazy right but on other people's beat he like since this is like a kiwi beat whoop, what can we say it's like he goes from rustage to as y'all called him before ristage that's like one of the most crazy that's the funniest nickname for this nigga whenever he gets saucy on a beat and such ristage ristage nah whoever made that comment before I'm pretty sure it was on when I reacted to his Sword and Sorcery album with him and Maguire. Whoever came up with that name, 
you goaded for that one. That I do it better, cause once you reveal, it's like I'm putting his case closed. Do it like, uh, case closed. I say the name and then they froze. Yeah. I put the pieces together, then lay out the facts yeah. of the truth, I don't make jokes. Yeah. Do it like, uh, case closed. Case one for the ups, I got laid low. Yeah. They know that I do it better, cause once you reveal, it's like I'm putting his case closed. One more thing, like I'm Frank Colombo. Yeah. Maybe small, but this man is cut though. In the fire, trying to vilify it, always tricking wire, not some magic mumbo. Kudos on it, in a case they unknown. Yeah. FBI, cause they speak in hush tones. Come to read, but also kind of dealer. They be like Serena, how they act so dumb though. Man, I like actors getting their wars like they won at the BAFTAs. Then we got the tools they don't know about a gasser. Put them in my scope like I'm rolling with NASA. You yeah. say think you're slow, I go fast. Put a man. Wait, what you said? Hold on. Run that back. You said put a man in a what? Then we got the tools they don't know about a gasser. Put them in my scope like I'm rolling with NASA. You yeah. say think you're slow, slow, I go faster. Man, like Hattori in Osaka. I don't care about what you after. I gon' wrap this up in a chapter. I gon' wrap this up in a night. There ain't none compared to this mind. If they read like Sherry, this is getting messy. But my head is steady, you can see it all in my eyes. I don't ever bet on the dice Put it all together, they expect the surprise Thinking that they planned every step of the crime But the aim of the sky, the detective won't find Do a lie, case closed I said the name and then they froze Put the pieces together, then lay out the facts of the truth I don't make jokes Honestly, if, if like I said, y'all let me know in the comments below who, What beats you think Rustage goes more crate, more better on His own beats Or other people's beat Because for me, personally I feel like whenever he goes on other people's beats, he be going stupid. Cause he went on when he was on DPS's most recent one, the Gear Five Luffy rap, he went stupid with it. You cannot tell me otherwise. He went stupid. So, hey, and this one with Kiwi and such, what can I say? I feel like he goes. Cause I know with his beats he more strategic with it and such, which is cool, right? I ain't saying nothing wrong with that. But on other people's beats, what can I say? With with DPS and when I with Kiwi, I be feeling like he has more of a. Well, I guess he wants to go for more of like a saucy vibe and such. Hey, and I'm with that. So. My head is steady, you can see it all in my eyes I don't ever bet on the dice Put it all together, they expect the surprise Thinking that they planned every step with the crime But I aim in the sky, the detective won't find Do it like, case closed I said the name and then they froze I put the pieces together, then lay out the facts of the truth I don't make jokes Do it like, case closed Run for the ups and go lay low They know that I do it better Cause once you prevail, it's a good point in this case closed Do it like, case closed I said the name and then they froze I put the pieces together, then lay out the facts of the truth I don't make jokes Do it like, case closed for the ups, I got laid low. They know that I do it better because once you reveal, the point in this case closed. Shout out to Kiwi on this beat. Nice little drill vibe and such. Think you're ready? Let's get to work. I'm ready. Now we're going to now an Asta song by Divide. Wait, did I say it was Divide? I said. Game Boy, Restage, Divide, yeah, they say. But now, this is a collab that, this is for the first time. Think about it. It's actually the first time we've seen this collab. Divide, Divide Music, and Cam Steady. With an Asta song, Never Giving Up. So, hey, nine times out of ten, when two artists collab for the first time, sometimes it be good, sometimes it be fire, so... But knowing how the nerdcore community is, whenever two artists collab for the first time, hey, they be going something insane. So, let's see what this one does. Black Clover. It's a Sword of the Wizard King. Because two, because both Cam and Divide have different ways of screaming at one another. Screaming and such. So, let's see how they do it here. To hear Cam on like a rock beat. See how he does. I was kind of expecting that in search with the yelling, but it sound, sounds so freaking good because it's more like, because whenever it's Cam on his own songs and such, he be going 
crazy on it. But sometimes when he collabs with other people's songs and such, with other people's beats, it sounds like he's more like polished, more like like more in tune and such. I don't know why. and that's it now so far right within this minute and 30 seconds and such it sounds good I ain't gonna lie and it's for the first time they collabing nah crazy you can run away from fate but you won't make it disappear Bro, with Cam, with Cam's type of lyric, lyricism and such, it's on the level of like Zach B and such, where it's like, like, really deep lyricism and such, but it's on like a lit term. It's like with some energy and such, cause with Zach B, his more like make you really, really like sit down and like, and such. But with Cam, he gonna give you that, but with some energy behind it. saying that nigga if I know something bad come in my way I'd rather come, come go head on with it then try to act like a B word and run nah see what I mean like with Cam he gonna have bars that makes you really go and such and actually come with some energy on it should if y'all remember me reacting to that like bloody daisies and such go go watch that reaction just type in humble ziggy bloody daisies reaction the way how that sounds compared to the vibe they sh those two all of them should have basically all of them should collab to one another because i guarantee you that would be like the perfect intro to not even just an anime, but to anything. Whether it be a movie, a video game soundtrack, no matter what it is. And even hell, motivation and such. So, mother man, they should collab with one another. I ain't gonna lie. <laughs>
Cam and Divide for your first time collab. That was fire. Cause it cause I never think of how Cam would really be on a divide type of production. So hey, first time. <laughs> All right, hold on now, hold on now. So, I want to say something before we get into this. Sorry for my phone. Now, I gotta say this. The last song now for this for the Fantastic Four reaction, Divide with <coughs> Sorry, Fable and Oricardia. Toji song down now. Tell me why y'all remember me saying in a video in one of my reactions where I said about how with Orcadia he's been going crazy. He's been on the likes of DPS's song, Rustage's song, and Schwabity and such. I'm surprised so far he needs to be on one with Divide and Fable. And Lord and behold, when I looked on Twitter, nigga. Tell me why in my head I predicted this shit. I know that y'all gonna say, in a way I kinda did predict it, right? Cause, nigga, with the way how Urukade has been blowing up this year and such, has been going on feature run and feature run and feature run and feature run and such, I'm surprised he wasn't on no Divide or Fable. And Lord and behold, we got this song right here. And they saying Fable slid, they saying Orcadia slid and Bloom Gums and Divide with the nuttiest free with the nuttiest instrumental. So hey, let's see what this instrumental is about. Oh now oh now we finally got sound in that and such. Alright, let's see what we got. around and put you on the nose i got dead dead bodies and i'm gripping sending two on my stick yeah six shots stick them out leave them in a dish yeah dish out i'll take them this year won't wait how to do it hot break the boys, nah nigga that the way how that freaking bass came in hold the fuck around nigga that bass came in nah y'all didn't y'all not might have known but I, the minute that bass hit me, I felt chills down my body. Hold the freak on. Fuck around and put you on the nose. I got dead, dead bodies and I'm gripping, sending two on my stick, yeah. Six shots, stick them out, leave them in a dish, yeah. Dish out. I said I'll take them this year. So he going, in a way, he going more hip-hop, more like hip-hop beats than rock. Oh, now nah, I'm like, I'm loving this. I'm loving this. High stakes life and I keep the place a bag. Keep a Draco in my pocket that I'd like to represent. Don't try to act like you know me now. Rockstar rich, you can't hold me down. And I'll really steal your bitch. You can't tell me nothing, now you've always been a snitch. Oh, God. Damn. You have always been a bitch, you can't really tell me nothing because you've always been a snitch. Now, I be telling you with Fable, Fable is just that nonsensical type of nigga where mother... Because cause like I said, in the realm of how Nerdcore, in a way can say building up, right? You would never think like most Nerdcore artists would curse or so. They would give you bars but not much of like a curse word or whatnot. 
with Fable, it don't freaking matter, cause nigga, he don't. It's like he said, nah, nigga, I'm a grown ass man. I'm a curse if I want to curse on my goddamn songs. Life and I get the place to bed. Keep a Draco in my pocket that I like to represent. Don't try to act like you know me now. Cross the rich, you can't hold me down. And I really steal your bitch. You can't tell me nothing now. You've always been a snake. Oh, God. Epic shit right here. Hold up. I'm a party! Do some little bitch, I knock Ooh. Bro, I like when Fable talks talks grimy on a beat, nigga, like, bro. Sometimes that's what I feel like what most rappers need to do, especially like this. Talk dirty on the beat, nigga. Especially this breakdown. <laughs> choice of I be saying hey Fable like what Fable said in like an interview with Internet City years ago his songs are like a roller coaster where it's just gonna keep building up building up building up until when you reach that climax it's like a roller coaster of emotions and such like he said but with the way you know how when roller coasters always have that little that little up that little upscale when you're going up and up and up with it like you loving the journey, you loving it so far, right? You loving it, but as soon as when you reach to the top, is right where that little stop at, right? And then as soon as when it gets, it stops for a second. You look at it, you pause, can't wait to see what happens, and then boom, you go down for the adventure. That's how big the songs are. Fully sweaty in this mother sucker. I ain't gonna lie to y'all. Hey, y'all let me know which which songs from this Fantastic Four reaction y'all like and such. Cause nigga, everybody slid on these beats. Like god damn. That's what that is why I always say y'all, y'all see the fan back there. Y'all always wonder why. Oh, why you have the fan on and such? Because, nigga, one, it be my room sometimes. It'll be a little hot. But also, two, nigga, the energy that these songs give me and such, these nerdcore songs give me, it's it makes me physically, like, feeling feeling like sweaty, sweaty and such. Like I'm glistening. <laughs> like, y'all not seeing it and such, but it feels like I'm glistening. That's why I wouldn't want to keep the fan on. But y'all be always saying about how y'all not hearing me and such, so that's why most of the times I turn off the fan. But nigga, when songs like these make me go freaking crazy with energy and such, then I would have to turn the fan on. But either way, 
Y'all let me know what y'all thought about this down in the comments below. Check out my other reactions right here. Follow me on all my socials up there. We on the road to 2K and such. And hey, if you want to catch, if you want a reaction request, hit me up on my cash app up there. Donate as much, donate as much money if you want to, like a ten dollar, up to ten dollars if you want to. And put what you want me to react to there on the cash app. But either way, it's been your boy Homer Ziggy signing out. Stay positive and keep the vibes up. Lego.